guys welcome back to today's video today this is what an entire car <laughs> truck full of dogs looks like wait are we missing one nope that's four we have four <laughs> anyway welcome to today today is dog day and it is the dog days of summer and we are gonna go and spend some time at some place super fun I mean, you if can, she's done puking, you I'm going to take her to the pet store. I'm going to take her everywhere. <laughs> so, Daisy did so good in the car, she you guys. She didn't even drool. She didn't even drool. It was she, amazing. Her first step is she drools, and then she whines, and then she throws up. So, where are we? We're at the beach. Let's go. So, we brought all of our dogs to the beach. Ruby. We're excited. Ellie is not used to being on a leash. Ellie, we can't just run. Hold on. Gosh. I am tangled up in dogs. Our dogs are not used to leashes, you guys know that. So there are other dogs, but we're gonna see if Daisy Dog runs, or we're gonna see. Oh, look! Well, Daisy's going in. Daisy's going in. Daisy loves it! <laughs> Ellie's like, oh, I've been dying for a drink. <laughs> go ahead. Uh oh. We got. You want to trace? Because my dog doesn't want to go. Come on, Ellie, come on. Come on. Oh, she's swimming. <laughs> there goes Ruby. I can't remember if Ruby's a, a water dog. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, I need a better leash. Hold on. Come on. <laughs> Come on, Molly! Kill. Oh, look, there's a fish! Molly saw it! Did you see that big fish? <laughs> My dog's like, I'll go! <laughs> so, she's our true water dog. She's swimming. Non-water dogs and water dogs and more water dogs and non-water dogs and water dogs. Sophie and I are just hanging out in the water. It's gorgeous. I've never seen the water this warm in June before. No, never. Look, look at the fish! Ellie. Look at the fish! Oh, 
All right, so I'm not gonna lie. Our dogs don't even, well, this one has her leash on, but this one doesn't have her leash on. That one doesn't have her leash on. Well, she has it on, but she's not being held. And our dogs are like chilling. Like our dog, we can take our dogs anywhere and they behave. Only one <laughs> I'm worried about is this one. <laughs> I should have brought a longer leash. There's one in the car. I might have to go get it because she just wants to run and roll in the sand. We're saying goodbye to the beach, you guys. We had so much fun. Ellie is kind of a beach dog. She kept getting free of her harness and just running around like crazy. And she kept running into the water, but she wouldn't go deep. Daisy actually went in the water. So I'm more proud, proud that she did not throw up. Yeah, we're really proud. She, this is the first time that she's gone in the car and not been car sick. Molly absolutely loved that. Sam threw stick after stick after stick. And when she got tired, she went and sat underneath the, the, the picnic table. Oh, that was worth it. It was just like worth it to stop in the middle of the day and go to the beach. I love impromptu trips to the beach. Ellie was good, but remember when I said, like, we can take our dogs anywhere. That's when everything went wrong for Ellie. <laughs> she kept breaking free of her halter, her harness, running around like crazy. And when I tried to catch her, she'd just run off. But she stuck with us. She stayed with us. I swear we are the only ones crazy enough to take four dogs someplace. So we are home from the beach and I made a gruesome discovery. I was outside cutting grass. Woo! Don't be whipping that thing around. And I found this. Anyway, it got caught in some netting. Woo! <laughs> Stop. Oh, jeez Louise. You know I'm saving your life here, buddy. Yeah, and... It, that's the thing. I hate snakes. Like, I hate snakes more than anything in the whole world. But I can't see it suffer. Like, it's just mean. Alright, we'll cut this off first, probably. <laughs> Don't have to hold this put it head. near me! <laughs> I don't right. hold his head or something. Alright, I'll hold that. No, just... Okay, like, if... If that thing comes running for me... Like I, that's why I can't garden at this house anymore. Even though I love nice gardens, I cannot because of the snakes. Like I, this is a snake house. Look, I feel like it knows that you're trying to save them now. Yeah, usually animals do know. Anyway, I, there's gonna be some screaming if he just takes off. Whew. Yeah, that's gonna take off. He can't take off though because he's trapped. You're trapped, buddy. You're trapped. We found a gruesome discovery on our farm. I called Sophie, and Sophie was like, "It's fine." She didn't even notice that it was trapped. I had to get Sam to help me. Okay, it is looking ferocious. But look at it. I think I got the one side, huh? Well, he's half free. Well, he's gonna be free. Get on go with that. Uh oh. There he goes. Well, now I'll never sit on that chair again. Where'd it go? It was stuck. It was yeah. all wrapped up in that wire. Yeah, yeah. And Dad had to cut it free. Did you see the piece that you chopped off? No, yeah, there was no piece, piece chopped off. It was bleeding. Where? The end of its tail. So he says I cut off the end of his tail with the lawnmower. It's, the tail was all there. Anyway, I'll never look at this furniture again without thinking that there's snakes under them. So that's the last time I ever sit on it. Don't you know that